day four. We're at Parkside Cottages, um, which backs up to Pine Tuning Lake State Park in Pennsylvania. And we're packing up and heading to Geneva on the lake today by route of Covered Bridge Tour. So this is day two of our Ashtabula Covered Bridge Tour. Come along for the ride. GoPro, check. Navigator, check. Ice tea, check. Water, check. GPS, check. Tires, check. Visitor information, check. Tires, check. Tires, check. Camera, check. Music, check. Okay, this was a weird one. Um, definitely built for cars and buggies. It's got tracks on right and left, and then the center is not level with those tracks. It actually is below those tracks. So when we're riding the spider, the rear of the spider is tilted at an angle backwards like this. So um, it was interesting. I had to double check to make sure nothing was dragging and also make sure that uh, our back wheel is centered fly on the lens so that uh, our back wheel was centered so that we weren't rubbing the uh, belt or anything like that. This one's definitely used by the Amish a lot. You can smell the horse manure. It smells like a horse barn in here. Pretty cool though for its age. On to our next one. Here we are in Jefferson at the Ashtabula County Courthouse. It is the last courthouse we needed to get in the Northeast. There it is behind me. That's it. Now Go find some more covered bridges. We are at the oldest single span covered bridge in Ashtabula County and it's also said that this is the oldest covered bridge in Ashtabula County.
Looks like you got some deets. I do. Mm. All right, we are where? Harper's Field Covered Bridge. Cool. And of course, it's in Ashtabula County. And got any historical facts about it? 228 feet long, second longest covered bridge in Ohio. Nice. Built in 1868. 1913 flood altered the river's channel, which is why the steel bridge is added on to it. Yeah. So the river got wider. Yes. Cool. And the is walkway it? was added in 92. Okay. Nice. Any other thing you need? No. Okay. We'll go check it out now. to Ohio's longest covered bridge and now we're taking you to Ohio's shortest covered bridge. Don't blink. Eighteen feet long. Oh, cool. So it was a vocational school project. <laughs> 